everybody, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sophia if you are new. Don't forget to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, leave me your thoughts and comments down below. And without further ado, let's just go ahead and get started in today's video. All right, so I filmed a Lululemon haul about, did I post it about a month ago or three weeks ago? Whatever, it doesn't matter. Um, you guys loved it, so that is awesome. I'm so happy. I love Lululemon. I'm obsessed with Lululemon. I love anything workout gear, really. I started really like buying a ton once quarantine hit because it was all I was wearing and it's all I still am wearing. And I thought, you know what? Why not just do another haul since I bought so much stuff? So that is what we're doing today. I am doing it a little bit different. I'm in a better lighting position. My last video I kind of felt was a little bit dark and dingy. I tried making it more of like a vlogish style video and I just felt like with the background it was too dark so I brought it back into my studio today and I'm using all of my lights um, my camera just to give you guys more lighting of when I'm talking and explaining things so that's what we're doing I'm also gonna be holding up product when I show it to you guys at first and then doing the clip in of me trying it on after so Without further ado, let's just start talking. So I actually bought this on the We Made Too Much section. If you didn't know, Lululemon does do a We Made Too Much section. They update it every Thursday. You have to check it every Thursday night if you want to try to get your size. Otherwise, it's very, very hard to get. Um, these are the Take Me There Crew socks. I'm a size eight and a half to nine, so I got the medium large. In this size, these are just a pair of white crew socks to work out in. I'm not going to do a try on for the socks because I feel like socks are kind of just socks and nothing to try on there. Um, but then the next pair I got is the Speed Ankle Sock Silver. Same size, medium, large. And this is the magenta color, I believe. Now, I bought the Speed Ankle Sock because I really wanted to try this. They were on sale. These are originally like $20 or $30 socks, which is ridiculous. I mean, for one pair of socks, like that's a lot of money. So I think these were like $9 or $20 on sale. Not 100% sure. Haven't tried them just yet, but they are made for running. And since I do run, I thought, why not give them a try? We'll see. I'll definitely keep you guys posted. I'll probably post on Instagram um, more about these once I wear them. So kind of just keep your eyes peeled for that. But once again, these are the Speed Ankle Stock Silver Lined. Now, moving on to the clothes. So I'm actually wearing the first one, and also I've got a little sweat here because I've been filming all day. But this is the Free To Be Serene Long Line Bra with like that really cool Lululemon back. And this is a size 10, and the color is Jade Green. Once again, I picked this up on the We Made Too Much section. However, I picked it up at like 1.30 in the morning randomly. I was just awake at night and saw this color pop up and I really wanted the jade green color because it's absolutely gorgeous. And it randomly pop popped up, added it to bag, immediately checked out and miraculously it shipped. Lululemon's been canceling so many of my orders recently with like really pretty um, limited edition colors and this was one of them so I'm really happy that I was able to get this I'm obsessed with this this is a light support bra for I think it said B to C cups and I'm a D cup definitely would not work out in this but I love wearing it lounging in it that type of thing so love this bra um, next up is this tank uh, I don't know if you guys can see it on camera but it just says Lululemon here across the front. This is the Breeze by Muscle Crop Tank. And this is in the shade um, Gray Sage. This actually isn't available either anymore. I paid full price for this. It is pretty expensive. It's a $60 tank top. But I don't know if you guys can tell on camera. I'm sure you'll be able to tell more than try on. It does have all the little perforation holes. I've ran in this a few times and I'm absolutely obsessed with it. I think it's so awesome. I actually just bought another one of these in the silver lilac color um, and that's still in stock. So I'll make sure I link this below. This comes in and out of stock. Just the gray sage is an awesome neutral staple color to have. Um, it's absolutely gorgeous. I'm obsessed with this. This is an actually a size 12. I'm usually an eight or 10 in their tops. But they only had a 12 when I bought this, so I went ahead and picked it up, and I'm happy I did, 
because I love having this in my collection. Sticking with some shirts, this is the cut back crop. I actually have them in two different colors. This first color is the washed lunar rock. It's a really pretty faded purple gray color. And then the back has a open hole and that's where the cut back comes in. This is a cropped muscle like um, tank. As you can see, the holes are pretty large, which I actually like because it gives me more ventilation and circulation in like my upper section when I'm working out. Um, like I said, this is in the shade Wash Lunar Rock. And then this absolutely stunning like teal color is in the shade Washed Tidewater Teal. I'm not sure if these are still available. I got them on sale on We Made Too Much for about $29 a piece, which is a steal because I believe these are like $58 originally and I just love the colors um usually with like my tops I'll go a little bit more bolder which when you see these next products you're gonna be like what are you talking about those are like really bold bottoms but I like going bolder with my tops and just pairing them with more staple bottoms also I love these tops because you can use them as everyday wear and everyday tops um and it doesn't look like a workout top so I love these tops I have tons of Lululemon muscle tees and crops and um tanks and they're absolutely amazing and then next for bottoms um I have three pairs of shorts to show you guys sorry I kind of just keep everything on hangers when I get it because I have like a rack that I store everything on but these are the what are these these are the hottie hot short and these are the four and a half inch I'm pretty sure or four inch length um I think it's four four but these are the hottie hots. They have like this really pretty like mesh down here. This was a style that also again went on We Made Too Much and I got them for a good deal so I picked them up. If I'm being honest, these aren't my favorite Lululemon running shorts. Um, I really enjoy the next pair I'm showing you and the tracker ones that I held previously that I'll leave that link down below. But this is the only pair of hottie hots that I actually have. And like I said, they're not my favorite. Um, I'm happy that I bought these um, on sale because I am i wouldn't buy another one of these shorts, I don't think. The print was really cool though, and I thought, why not? I don't have anything like them. Also, this was like the first pair of running shorts besides my black trackers I have that I bought from Lululemon. So I wanted to give these a try, and then once again, these are in a size 10. I said in my last video, I like sizing up two sizes in their shorts. They all have a drawstring, and you can tie them, and I just like a looser fitting running short. That's me personally, um, but if you are to get any of their shorts, I would recommend sizing up at least one size, because um, you can cinch in the waist and be a-okay. So next couple shorts, these are actually literally the same exact shorts. You can already see like... The colors of them that's why when i said i like to do like um neutral colored pants i was like oh my god this is not doing well um so these are these speed up mid-rise shorts these are four inch and all the shorts that i get are always lined so this is in the shade daydream once again got these on the we made too much um just randomly one night and they are so stinking cute um, this is what they look like. I love the speed up shorts so much. The color is absolutely gorgeous. It has like a nice zip in the back where I can put like my house key when I'm on a run. Um, and the daydream shade is so pretty. This is like one of those colors, kind of like the jade green bra, that when you see it and you like it, you just have to buy it because it's probably going to go out of stock and they don't always restock. Are the So once again, these are the speed up shorts in a size 10. And they are the four inch in the shade Daydream. And then the next speed up short I have, this is a, so I got, I keep feel like I keep saying I got this on We Made Too Much. But I once again picked these up on We Made Too Much just sporadically at night once. This is the Magenta Glow color. It's such a pretty pinky purple shade. These are a size 12. They are way too big for me. You'll see that on the try on. Um, but I still wear them. They're just very, very loose and I have to really like suck in the jawstring on them. But since I got them when we made too much, they only had a 12. So I thought whatever, I'll just buy them. Who cares? And that's what I did. Um, they work though. They get the job done. They stay up. I don't have any issues with them at all. And I just really loved the color. I really wanted a pink running short. So I went ahead and just thought I'll just buy them. I'll make it work. And that's what I did. Um, I love the length on the four inch shorts. 
I never bought a two and a half inch short because all the reviews I saw everyone said they're just way too short and really ride up you and especially being like 5'8 I feel like it would just be a disaster. Last thing I have in this haul is a pair of leggings. So these are the Wonder Train leggings. Um, I got these in a size 6. Yeah, size 6. These are the Wonder Train High Rise Tight 25 inch size 6 and the shade Cassis, I believe is how you say it. Um, so I have multiple Wonder Trains um, and I really, really love them. They remind me of the Align Pant just they're more sweat wicking and they're more for working out. The Wonder Train also, like I showed you guys in my last haul from the Diamond Dye Shorts, it has this drawstring so you can really cinch in the waist and make it tight if you want. A lot of people said to size up in these. Um, I went true to size. You can do true to size if you want or you can size up, I think. I could go to an eight if I really wanted to. However, every time I size up in Lululemon and leggings, I instantly regret it because they do stretch as you wear them and you wanna keep that in mind. Like even with the lines, I can size down to a four because I know they'll stretch, but I just stay true to size and they're usually fine. I bought one legging and an eight once from Lululemon and they were just instantly too big after I've worn them a few times. So I like to stay true to size in every single Lululemon thing, legging that I get because I've made the mistake before and it's way too much money um, to not do so. But I really like the Wonder Trains. I actually haven't done like a high intensity workout in them yet because where I live it is super hot and I've been wearing shorts to the gym or shorts on my runs lately, but I'm really excited to try these out um, and use them. So yeah, these are the Wonder Trains in the shade Cassis and the 25 inch length. Everything that I picked up for this haul, um, I did get quite a bit more things. However, they're still shipping or I just didn't want to include them in this haul and make this video like 40 minutes. I will do more Lululemon hauls and space out the products. That way you guys are able to really get and see all of them that I have recently bought. But I hope you guys enjoyed this Lululemon try on haul. Like always, thank you so, so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Leave me your thoughts and comments down below and I will see you guys next time. Bye guys.